Uh, hey, so I just took the plastic off my roll and it's like unboxing. The funny thing, you really never know what you'll see, you, what you will see. So remember I had some leaves in the bottom and then I have some leaves on the top of the scarf and the scarf I um I put some um paper towels which I uh dipped and some natural dyeing like what this was cochineal let's look on that side see how that side the sleeves are coming down so it's it's interesting to see what leaves actually leaves any prints on that Oh, look on that. Uh, I think it was some type of an oak. And, oh, look on that. This was um, uh, maple. I think it was rose. So these guys left like dark prints. And uh, they left it right on the scarf. Uh, <laughs> not that four leaves happened. Because you, you can see... Oops, oops, oops. Mm. Some of see how so this is like a little it's a little light. I don't know why. And this is actually on the paper. Ah no, wait a minute. So part of it is scarf, but so part of it it's um paper. So this is what you see. It actually was printed on the paper from the other side. This is what happened, interesting. So next time, instead of paper, I will try another scarf. So, but this is the leaves which were in the bottom. So the scarf is actually right here. So, whoa, huh, cool. So this was big leaves. I put it on the bottom. I was thinking it will be like a background. Now let me, let's look for more. So, cochineal and um, matter was the, um, those natural dyes which were on the um, paper towel. So I dipped paper towel, I put it on top of that scarf. So, Then I wrapped everything in plastic, plastic, and I steamed it for, I would say about a good couple, of two, three hours. Uh, and let it sit for a night. So it see, so it's layers. layers. And this is uh, the paper. The paper was on top of uh, that scarf. So it was a uh, scarf. Then it was leaves, and it was that uh, paper towel on top of the leaves, which also got pretty cool prints. Yeah, yeah, I could use something else instead of paper just to. Oh, now this is <laughs> all my leaves are here stuck. You know, they look so a cool print. I could use it. Another scarf could be fun too, and this it will be dark. And um, before I actually start doing it, I treated my silk scarf. I just have it. I just have fun taking off the sleeves and looking at all the prints, right? Oh. <laughs> fun. Fun. <laughs> okay, you know, this is a waste. I mean, you can say, yeah, oh, sorry, we should. You should use something else and it will be another piece, but it's okay. It's okay, it's just all experiments. Now look what how the scarf looks. This is a uh, nice hundred percent silk and uh, I treated it a little bit in um, alum sulfate, alum, the one which they use for pickling. I still think it's very pretty. I mean, I you don't have um, any perfect um, shapes, but you can still see 
some vines from the sleeves and uh, uh, again not as all of them look like this one really didn't leave any big of a print this was a nice um supposed to be a good print coming from maple but it didn't happen well no it's interesting because what i'm trying to do mostly i'm trying to experiment with the local plants because we just moved in this area last year and i'm just trying to figure it out what's really working no i'll tell you i'll wash that scarf in warm water and soap and um, see how much of this red will leave and how much of that um what will change so something will change it will definitely not be so bright but i think it's still pretty cool i think i should just keep doing it okay thanks for watching bye